All right, Schlockmeister fans, hitting an old Disney one here. It's called Lefty the Dingling Links. Let's check it out. But of course, such dotted line divisions just don't exist in the wilderness world. And so this Canada lynx was unaware and didn't care that she and her family were out of their own dominion. Right we have a lynx and her three it kittens. Was a good move, and up to a point was going well. At least as far as youngins one and two were concerned. But as usual, number three was something else. It was right here that he made that wrong left turn on the highway of life. Well, this couple almost hit the lynx. Sort of looks like a wildcat. Well, we can't leave it here. It'll get run over. And unsupervised is something I'll never understand. So they bring uh, bring it to the ranger station. We'll try to find this young fellow, Mama. He's probably watching closer from now on. Well, I certainly hope so. Uh, thank you both for all the help. So Joel, the forest ranger, puts the links up a tree. Worked. But just to make sure... Take time to wait around and keep an eye on the helpless youngster. But the lynx proves to be too helpless to be on its own for now. Hold it easy now. So what's Joel to do? Cap, you're either completely ding-a-ling or you've got a left-handed approach to the business of staying alive. That little kitten had just got himself adopted. Naturally, he'd need a name. Equally naturally, it would be Lefty. So Joel adopts Lefty. That disarrayed nest was no place for a peace-loving dog. Especially since the boss was about due back from getting the mail. That dog's name is Brandy. Joel's boss shows up. It's a mm -hmm. uh, orphan. Mm -hmm. Just thought I'd take care of him until he can take care of himself. Turn him loose. Mm -hmm. Well, Brandy and Lefty hit it off. And they encounter other wildlife such as an elk. Lefty's gotten pretty big now. Some time has passed. Time to turn them loose. This was a trip that had to be made. So Joel tries to dump off Lefty. Lefty, will you cut it out? Lefty's not going very easily, though. Brandy misses his friend. Time and again, Brandy made the rounds of Lefty's old hiding places. And her spirits dropped lower and lower. A disappointment followed disappointment. Lefty Finn has to fend for himself now and encounters a bear. Lefty makes a new friend. Oh, Lefty's going to get himself caught in a trap. That's a Wolverine. Turns out Ranger Joel and Brandy are nearby. And they heard the ruckus between the Wolverine and the Lefty in the cage. And Lefty is reunited with Brandy and Joel. Nice going, Lefty. Figured this would bring you back in the family fold, huh? <laughs> Doesn't take a lot of figuring. The grumpy warden came back again, so. Relocation of Lefty. 
This time, Joe was going to haul him clear to the far side of way over yonder. All right, releasing him once again. Lefty encounters a cougar. Around here, this king cougar was number one cat. Lefty encounters snow that for the first, first time. Snow took a little getting used to. Joel creates some little avalanches with some dynamite so as to avoid a big one later. Brandy grabbed the next piece of dynamite that was lit. Drop it, drop it, Brandy. Lefty finds them again. Well, I'll be Lefty. <laughs> well, Brandy and Lefty get lost. What's up? Did you see my dog and the lynx along here? The what? My setter and that tame lynx. They must have slipped out when we were talking back there. Did you happen to see them? Nope. Well, I've been watching the road, though. I could have missed them. So the two of them are lost for a couple of weeks. Would escape all danger. When they finally ran into trouble, it was deadly and double. A pair of timber wolves. Eventually they do get found just in time to uh, enter uh, Brandy in the uh, dog sled competition again. Brandy never once slowed the pace over all that 15 mile course. And then she brought Joel's team honking down the home stretch with an average of less than four minutes for every mile. Let victory slip right out of his grasp. Wouldn't you know Maybe Lefty gets involved? The one against Lefty showing up. But he did. Well, there was the cat. Here came the dogs. And there went the old ball game. Lefty's gonna help Joel win. Lefty caused the perfect diversion. Lefty didn't know or care about that finish line. It just happened to be between him and where he wanted to go. And of course, Brandy just wanted to catch up with old friend Lefty. And all that made Joel the dog derby winner. Our movie ends with Lefty getting a wife. Plainly, any friend of Lefty's was not necessarily a friend of the brand new Mrs. Lefty. In fact, she was ready to claw that redhead's eyes out. All right, let's talk about Lefty the Dingling Lynx. This is a movie that I have a little bit of a history with. Uh, the very first month we had cable, which was March of 1982. This movie was on. It was on quite a bit, actually. Now, back then, uh, 
we had the movie channels, uh, HBO Showtime and the movie channel, and they would show this movie. Back then, uh, the, there wasn't these contracts that these individual ha channels have um, with the various uh, studios and such where you could see a movie, and it was on all three networks, all three of those uh, premium channels. Um, uh, that changed a few years later. But anyway, at this time, this is a Disney movie, actually. Uh, it came out on the, I think it was called The Wide World of Disney back in 1971, TV made. Um, but it was being shown on HBO and stuff uh, back in 1982. And that's where I saw it. In fact, that's where everybody saw it. Uh, when I was in school at that time, I was a little kid, and everybody watched Lefty the Dingling, Dingling Links. It was on several times. Shortly after that, there was also Charlie the Lonesome Cougar, which was also shown quite a bit. That actually came out four years earlier. In fact, there's a cougar in this movie who looks just like Charlie. Maybe it was the same cougar. I don't know. In fact, the, the guy who plays Joel in this movie was the star of Charlie the Lonesome Cougar also. Anyway, Lefty the Dingling Links. Uh, it I, it's basically tells a story about this lynx named Lefty who was born, and uh, um, he, he gets uh, taken by this couple. They find this uh, little kitten, a uh, lynx. They bring it to the forest ranger, and the forest ranger kind of adopts him a little bit. And, and the lynx befriends his dog, Brandy, his Irish setter. Eventually, he's got to let, let Lefty loose out in the wilderness, which he does. But Lefty eventually finds his way back, and he kind of adopts him again a little bit. And basically, what you see in this entire film is a friendship between Lefty... Uh, the dog Brandy and Joel the forest ranger um, and uh, we see the trials and tribulations of Lefty as he confronts bears and cougars and wolverines and whatever else uh, there were some wolves actually at one point too um, but he always manages to find his way back to Brandy and Joel and at the end of the movie uh, Brandy is actually involved in a um, dog sled race uh, which Lefty kind of interferes with and helps him win so there you go anyway it's just a, a charming little film it's it's kind of silly but it, it is what it is it's a Disney movie it's great for kids it's very very difficult to find this thing it's never been released on VHS or DVD Charlie the Lonesome Cougar has been but this one has not um, this is a, a homemade DVD-R I have a VHS tape of this which I got from somebody at some point it looks like it was taped off of uh, the Disney Channel back in the mid 90s or something, um, and some homemade box art, obviously, too. So, very little information about this online as well. Uh, I saw like one or two reviews, period. So, anyway, it's Lefty the Dingling Links. I like this movie, it's very nostalgic for me. Um, again, it's impossible to find, but I'm very curious if anybody else has, uh, has seen it, this movie besides me. Uh, if you were in Two Rivers, Wisconsin back in uh, the early 80s, I know you did, but I don't know if any, any of those people are watching. So, anyway, check it out Lefty the Dingling, Dingling Links. Let me know what you think about it. Leave some comments down below. We'll talk about it. Watch it. Bye.